and I really don't know whether I'm ready, whether my, my party is ready for this fight, but we're going to jump in, we're going to see how we do, and if, it's, if it seems like we are super overmatched, then I'll do some off-stream leveling, and we'll play something else for an hour today. Bah! The warmest welcome to you both. I do hope you found my holes to your pleasure. They may lack the grandeur of lasagnas, but I find they make up for it in other ways. Castles built as seats of governance are so dreadfully plain. Would you not agree? There is such greater beauty in a fortress than for war. Oh, how's the deep voice? Is the deep voice working? I think I started off the program. The release herself would seem to be in agreement. Ever has she been ruled by men with power? Some might take this latest upheaval as a sign that the crown, in its austere seat, has lost the strength to keep her under reign. Your summoned spirit of the masses is more pressing than the style of the Sarah's keep. <laughs> Must <laughs> everyone be in such haste? Very well, I shall ask you outright. Will you not join your strength with mine? I am afraid your meaning is against me, your grace. As I said a moment ago, it is power that rules evil is. Who do you think now holds power? Duke Log and the Order of the Northern Sky? Duke Goldhana, mayhap, with the Southern Sky swords at his beck and call? No, I can assure you, it is not they. The ones who hold true power are the, the ones who hold the Zodiac Stones, the Knights Templar. You think us the greatest power in evil ace. The Stones are said to possess phenomenal magic. If legend is to be believed, they were responsible for the catechism that laid waste Mulan in bygone days. <laughs> oh, forgive me. I forget myself. It's just... I would never have expected a man like yourself to believe in such utter fantasy. You mean to tell me that you do not? <laughs> Curious. I had heard the Cardinal's death was somehow connected to the stones. Truly, as I had it. The Cardinal had taken ill. Is that so? Might I ask then, the reason that you seek that young Beowulf? I can only imagine what he must have done to earn the label of heretic. The Inquisitors do not do share with man. us the race of decisions. Probably not a mayor dropping mighty gifts on Pac-Man. That's a, another 12-monther. Thank you so much, a mayor. So, oh, you know nothing at all. Nothing at all. Like anything I had felt before. Oh, nothing at all. Nothing at all. Like I thought, it was so much more. No one else has ever made me feel this way. When I asked you how you did it, you'd just say... Sorry, I got a heart song stuck in my head. <laughs> how terribly convenient. Still, I wonder if there could not be some detail you are simply forgetting. Morik! Father, forgive me. <laughs> Your meaning becomes clearer. I've taken Scorpio and Taurus for safekeeping. You weren't this fool of a son. Pardon my intrusion, Your Grace, but your long-awaited guests are at a gate. Mark, would you kindly see to them? What is it you wish, Barrington? Cooperation. I said as much a few moments ago. It would be a mutually beneficial arrangement, I assure you. And if we were to refuse? 
Then I suppose I'd be forced to unmask the church's plot for what it is. Stones alone prove naught. In that case, in that you are correct, sir. But it would be hard to say the same of the scriptures of Germanique. I dare contend they might generate something more of a stir. Duke Log, Duke Dotonna, even the councillors like Tereus and I at these. Where are they? No, oh, who could say? You of all people must know how easily such details can elude the mind's grasp. Do not think to threaten me. This is a battle you cannot hope to win. You would raise arms against your host under his own roof? The hospitality of your all grows cold. I fear I shall have to take my leave once I've shown you the power of the stones. Please, Mark, heed my words. We can leave this place together. Death is the price for disloyalty. You know this as well as I. The Grand Duke sees our deaths paid in kind. Torn cloaks are set upon by their once friends, hunted relentlessly until the end. To flee this day is to live your rest in fear. Ever wandering, when the knife will find its mark. Such is not a life I choose to lead. If we but finish this one last task for him, the Grand Duke will release us both from his service. He swore as much to me. Swart on what? His honor? Do not tell me you believed him. The man's words are honey poison. I would sooner deal with the devil. They make not such effort to conceal their lies. The Grand Duke would not lie to me. We need only kill that man and take the scriptures from his corpse. And then our chains are cut. Alright. Port and Tunch, here we go. Oh, baby! Uh, yeah. Get wrecked, fool. God, Bombs is such a beast. Twice fought and twice defeated. I have no match for this one. You cannot run from me, Marek. This is the only problem with that Rush Merrick strat is now they're all going to focus down Bomza. But if his auto potion can proc, we'll be in business. Ooh, I should have checked. I should have checked to make sure that I have enough, um, enough potions. Rend Helm. Ah, my headband, you jerk. Yeah, I don't think it's super likely that the stat the status effect's gonna proc, so I should probably just, yeah, just go for damage. Joel, um, yeah, I'm liking, I'm liking that idea. Get that off before. Hopefully this should protect Bomza from those archers, and then next turn he and Agrius can try and get up there and start wrecking their shit. Boom! Enjoy my jumps! Yeah, there we go. Boom. Get punched! Blocked from behind? What the? Twice in a row, no less? That's uh, all a whole shit, but okay. Golem putting in work. You love to see it. Ooh, no proc on the auto potion on either of those dudes. It's a little rough. If I just attacked him. Nope, wouldn't be enough. Alright, another jump ought to do it here. Well, should I move first, though? Protect on Mustadio, maybe. Get right here and try and hit them both. Nope, that ain't gonna do it. Unfortunate. Alright. Self-protect. Get wrecked. Another 
go. Get him where it hurts. Bam! Bam! Yeah! How you like me now? Ooh, plus 90 to her. She must have, um... What she got? Gaia gear? Yup, yup, Gaia gear. Okay. Well, glad I realized that that wasn't SMRT. Kind of a waste of Bombs' beastly attack to off this night, but somebody's got to do it. Hey, there we go. Now we're talking. Get him, Skeeter. Wow. That's more like it. <laughs> oh, I was about to say almost kills her. And then with the crit, it totally does. All right. Well, that fight was not half bad, but as I recall, they get harder from here. So we shall see. Claws and fang. Claws have mercy. Pray let them be safe. Alma and Rafa too. Bombs. What's happening? <laughs> Those wounds are terrible. What did this to you? The beast with oh God, my limbs grow cold. Be strong, sir. Be gone from here, my lady. There is only death here. Exit stage left. So you've come. Draw your sword, Bomza. Not in the mood? I hope you will not object to me drawing mine. I'm. I expect as a barehanded fighter, right? Now, it's, I, that it would actually be counterintuitive, counterproductive for me to draw. You know what? Never mind. I'll punch you later. <laughs> I pity you, Weegriff. You knew the job was dangerous when you took it, Fred. <laughs> yup. I pity you, Weegriff, more than you can know. What must Maluda think to see you now? You would sell your soul to the Lukavi to slake your thirst for revenge. Revenge? You think that is what drives me? I have no such petty concerns. I do not fight to avenge Maluda's death. I sow the seeds of chaos in the world of men and reap the angriest cries of the weak. But worry not, Bamza. Yours is a special case. I shall kill you myself. Little revenge, small, a small revenge. <laughs> what up, Survivor? Okay, four. Range is four, so if I just... I'm gonna try it. There we go. Yeah, just put the maximum distance between us. And start tailwinding. That's the one I want, right? Yep, boost speed. See, this is why I like to have... Um, this is why... I like to have monk abilities because being able to chakra myself is a nice thing in this battle. Nope, didn't work. Well, we are going to rely on that auto potion to save me. 
Well, I tailwind again. I'm gonna hope the auto potion procs this time, because I'm going to have to take an attack here. Seventy auto potion, nice. Okay, cool. Another tailwind. I need to be consistently getting two turns to his one, and then I can start boosting. Yeah, it's really just those first couple turns that I gotta be a little careful. From this point on, it should be easier. We'll do one more Tailwind. Okay, now I'm... Oh, yep, yep. As far down as we go, I've always got two turns to his one. So now I can start focusing. Throw in just one more Tailwind just to be safe. In fact, I think I'll do a, a Tailwind and a Focus. Okay, misjudged that. That's unfortunate. But he shouldn't be able to kill me. And in fact, I just healed up more than he more than he did to me, so that's fine. So let's see. So, uh, oh, by the way, hi, Yodanashi. Hi. I assume you're just going to be fast forwarding through this shit, but hi. Because <laughs> this is about to get real repetitive real quick. So that does it for him. We're going to see whether that's enough for the next form. <laughs> but that is, in fact, Weegriff down. He 
you are stronger than I had thought. You cannot one run, Regriff. I should be fine. I should be fine. Show yourself. This has gone on long enough. I am come. You fight alone no more. Then nor shall I. Here join me, followers loyal and true. They are come too. The battle is now joined, Bonza. Behold, for true fell power of the dark. Defeat Belias. Commence. So like, this is the part where I'm, I'm kind of like, how hard am I, how hard am I going to abuse these save states? Because like, if that hadn't gone off right there, am I really going to reset this whole sequence of fights? Or, well, back to his last phase and do all that grinding again? I don't know. <laughs> Enjoy that, motherfucker. Oh man, okay. He, he's still hungry for more. Have a second helping. Enjoy! Brought down by the hand of mortal man! Curse your cheesing this battle system! <laughs> Yeah, welcome to my fisting dungeon and such. <laughs> You're going to be all right. My sword, where is my sword? I must stop him. Stop it. Won't you fetch a taper to kindle some light? It is so dark here. It's all right. You needn't fight any longer. Rest yourself. Your brother, tell him for me. The Oran sight a foul work, evil. My father, nay, that was no longer my father. Transformed by the Aura sight, <laughs> one of the Lukami. You should not speak. Bamza was right. It must be stopped. It could destroy all of Ivalice. Such power. You must tell them. Tell them all they must cease their fighting. Together they must face a greater threat. Where's my sword? My arm does not heed me. Be still now. I saw its body in the hall. My brother slew it. It is done. It is dead, slain, that I might rest. In my doublet, a piece of oracite. You must give it to your brother for me. I will. Thank you. My eyes are weary, heavy with sleep. Let them rest for a little while.
Whose voice is that? Ah, so here you are. I shall speed you to join the others. You needn't fear. Your death shall be quick. Elias, I've defeated him. So this, this is my this is my one criticism with this game's story, which is really quite good. But from this point on, it becomes just a never-ending your princess is in another castle. <laughs> Actually, for a while before this point, too, like you get there and like, oh oops! Gotta go to the next place where she's at now. Your brother is ill luck for us. Come, we're leaving. You could it really be? My apple luck turns. I should have I should not have thought to find our quarry here. I had feared we might search another century or more and still not find you. What are you talking about? Release me. Do not worry. Your life is safe. Now come! After all I've done for you, you now repay me with betrayal. You owe me your life, you ungrateful wretch. You would not stand here today were it not for me. Did you prefer digging through sordid heaps of rubble? Or have you already forgotten that? Oh, I recall that quite clearly. It was after you burnt our village, was it not? Shortly after you murdered my mother and father and everybody else. It is not this betrayal I repay your deeds. It is this vengeance. Vengeance? You truly believe that you are capable of exacting vengeance on me? I am your father, Rafa, the man who raised you from a girl. You cannot kill your own father. Then the Emperor has already won. No, you are welcome to try. You cannot do it. Do you know why? The flesh remembers, Rafa. It remembers fear, cold and trembling. But it will not always be so. In time, your fear will blossom into another flower. And I shall have that one as well. Yup! You just read that shit right! Welcome to the accurate translation. Yup! It's true, isn't it? You meant the words you spoke just now. You turn on me, on me as well, Mark. You truly are an ungrateful lot. I'll kill him. I will. Rafa, no. Yeah, that's right. Get shot, fool. Mark. Speak to me, Mark. Oh, Fasa, no. Rafa, Marek! You must be Bomza! Move no further! If you wish to help your brother, Rafa, bring me the order site he carries! It should be on his person. Check his robes! Yes, that is it. Bring it to me! Quickly now, I grow impatient! <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. I wonder if you would not relinquish it to me instead. No, dear, this is not a game of hide the stone. Bring it here. Guard yourself, Rafa. Those are no humans. 
You must be the heretic, Bamza. I suppose I owe you my thanks. Forgive me for not expressing my gratitude sooner. I would have you know I am not a violent man like Falmarv. Will you not yield the stone of your own accord? I do so hate to see blood spilt needlessly. Spare me the struggle and I shall be glad to ask Falmarv to return your young sister. What have you done with her? Mayhap I did not make myself clear. I would have the stone if you would speak more of that. I cannot let worry sway me. It must not go to him. An adoring brother you must be to trade your sister for a stone. After all you faced in coming here, you leave her to her fate. I have no words for you. Indeed, it seemed the time for words is past. Celia, Letty, the girl carries the orosite. Take it from her corpse. I'll forget if attacking him is a good idea or not. We're gonna, we're gonna find out. Uh, okay, we're gonna cheese this slightly because this fight is bullshit. There we go. So, this is the strength that felled the Gygus and Kukulain as well. Celia, Letty, come. This knight is lost. If you wish to claim the orosite I hold, Bamza, you had best make your way to Limbury. I shall await your coming there with bated breath. Ooh. Look, Marek, a new dawn is risen. Can you not see it? So often we sat together talking, waiting for the coming of the first light. We'd talk of the journeys we wanted to make together, wouldn't we? How when the war ended, we would go back and visit our old village. You remember, Marek, don't you? Don't you? Tell me you do. Tell me you still go. Wait for me, Alma. What's this? The Orasite cries with her. It resonates with the grief in her heart. Z Wegriff's heart was full of sorrow as well, and despair. And those feelings summon forth. You grieve for him as well? Thank you. No, Rafa, you must not listen to that voice! <laughs> Pardon me. Do my eyes deceive me? <laughs> Marek! Rafa, where are we? Why am I here? Oh, Marek, thanks to gods, you're alive! Oh, do you mean to suffocate me? <laughs> also, Mark got off way too goddamn easy. Fuck that guy. Another Zodiac Stone. But why would it be here? I thought Orasite a product... Not of godly fashion, but an issue of hands far fouler. A gateway of sorts for Lukavi into our world. I know not by whose hands it came to be, 
but I do not think it's evil inherent. I believe it is the wielder who gives its power shape. I shall save you, Alma. Come what may. Frustration with the stalemate growing. The Order of the Northern Sky recalled its full force from the war's now expansive front. They marched on Fort Besselat with plans to turn the tide of the war. I sort of don't want him to see my nethers. But I can steal your gear, so allow. Fine. If you must. Piece of shit. I have not seen such slaughter. There are corpses at every turn. But your sister was not among them, was she? No, she's not here. They had her in the castle, I'm sure of it. They must have taken her elsewhere during the fighting. Three men from the Templar had arrived not long before you. Three, and no more. One became a Lukavi. I killed him myself. Another, Isalud, was slain in the melee. This third must have taken Alma. No doubt he brings he means to bring her to Mulond. Mulond is the seat of the church's power. They act in High Confessor Marcel's name. Where else would he go? <laughs> yes, exactly. Work for free food. <laughs> I wonder. I do not think their High Confessor knows the true power of the stones. Consider this. Wegruff did not know their secret until he had struck his bargain with Belias. And by the look of things, Isalu died fighting the Lukavi. What are you getting at? By inciting this war, the church hopes to broaden its power. Clearly, this is the High Confessor's ambition. But he only wants the Zodiac Stones for their symbolic power, to sway the minds of the people. Do you imply that someone is using the High Confessor's ambition to some other purpose? This third man in the Templar's party, who is he? I cannot say for sure, but I believe it was Lord Formarv. Commander of the Knights Templar. He is the key. What will you do? I travel to Zeltenia. Delita is there, and I must see him. He succeeded Baron Grimm's in leading the Black Ram Knights, did he not? The Church and the Knights Templar manipulate Delita from behind the scenes. Or do they? <laughs> With luck. He can shed some light on who this Lord, Lord Fulmarv is and what he wants. Chapter 4. In the name of love. Chapter 4. In the name of love. Oh, welcome home, my lord. Yeah, home. You are well. All right. I am, thank you. What news of the war? Ha, none good as you know well enough. War is a dirty enough affair when you know who your enemies are, but this, ha, ha, would that my name were our only casualty. Oh, yeah. Well, I should think Duke Gotana's name in greater peril. They say his other lord's bannermen remain here only because you do. Leave such foolish talk to fools. When a member of House Orlando pledges his lord fealty, he honors that oath, though it cost him his life. Oh, I'm sorry, I spoke over much. Words of wind. Now this errand I set you to, I would hear of it. The reports are true, my lord. The crystal discovered beneath Gaug, the stone the late cardinal found in the ruins at Zelmonia. Both are a sight for true by all accounts. The Knights Templar, too, are passing busy, though the object of their labors I cannot say. Do our ears in Mulan hear nothing? 
Here, yeah, perhaps, but dead men tell no tales. If only we had some evidence of the High Confessor's plot, we might use it to compel a peace. This shall not long remain hidden from their gaze, and then the storm will be upon us. <laughs> <laughs>